去年大选期间，格雅公司老板罗伯特·乌纳努应邀到白宫讲话，支持川普“美国优先”的理念。川普和女儿伊万卡大力支持格雅，但 C N 等媒体对此进行攻击，极左翼的取消文化，甚至抵制格雅产品。乌纳努表示，去年极左翼的抵制反而引发美国人的购买潮。Once I said blessed, and that was unacceptable to the far left cancel culture. So there were calls for a boycott, but many people in this country said this is not right. We're going to buy Goya products, and the, a, this tremendous boycott was formed. Wu Nanu said, "Cancel culture is cancel the belief in God." And I've come to realize that a lot of what we're doing is canceling God. They want to the cancel culture wants to take God out of everything. They want to cancel God. They want to close our churches. They want to redefine the family. Wu Nanu 将取消文化比作纳粹，都是在宣扬仇恨。Building up hatred against anybody who maybe supported President Trump or thinks one way differently than this cancel culture. So it's, now it's acceptable to hate. Them to put labels on those people as racist, supremacist, white supremacist, or whatever, and that has to stop. Wu Nanu 表示，川普总统希望保持开放，格雅公司和德州等地没有因为开放而感染更多病例，反而业绩更好。That's what President Trump wanted to do. He wanted to keep the economy going. He didn't want to close it down, because if we had closed down, if the economy had closed down. Forget about coronavirus; we all be dead. 关于大选，乌纳努分享了一个奇妙故事。他的朋友听到上帝说，美国将承受更多苦难，从而曝光邪恶，让世人看清美国已走上歧途。Said the U.S. isn't ready; we need to suffer more. So wow, and why is that? We need to suffer to realize to the to what level of division and hatred we can go, so that people can. Re、realize that we're heading down the wrong path. Wu Nanu 表示，美国遭受的一切会促使人们抵制仇恨和分裂。他还提到，有预言说，川普会重新领导美国。Predicted that President Trump would bring this nation closer to God, and maybe by all this happening and us seeing what is upon us right now, it'll unite this country together. And reject a culture of hatred and division, and foment a culture of love and building. 新唐电视纽约报道。